place is. Well, it's a place you'll hear people referring to a lot throughout the show. You hear the news? They carted old so and so after here in town the other day. Is that so? What do you do? Oh, such and such, I hear. What do you know? Old so and so. It's kind of a mythical place, do you understand? A bad place. A place you won't see until like two, and then, well, let's just say it's filled with symbolism and things like that. But you're in town. Welcome. It takes place in a town like any town that you might find in a musical. This here is the first setting. Now, as the sign says, it's a public amenity, meaning public toilets. These people have been waiting for hours to get in. It's the only amenity that they can afford to get into. Say that, Mr. Is this what you tell the audience about the water shortage? What's that, little Sally?
girl to attend to. I haven't got it. Then go get it. Come on, Penny, I'm good for it. That's what you said last week, and I still haven't seen Penny White. And it's Miss Pennywise to you. Bobby, Bobby isn't with the woman. I'm a little short this morning. No shorter than yesterday, unless I've grown. But he's my mom, Miss Pennywise. <laughs> and I'm going for free. <laughs> Just this once. Get your head out of the clouds, Bobby Strong. No one gets in for free. Now, Miss Pennywise, we've all had to make special arrangements with people in high places over the years. Why not let this one be out? If all that song is a green song, why not? Yeah. Yeah. No one's getting anywhere for free. Don't you think I have bills of my own to pay? Don't you think I have taxes and tariffs and payoffs for me too? Well, I do. And I don't pay them with promises, see? I pay them with cash. Cold, hard cash. Every morning you all come here, right? Every morning somebody about this boy I ain't gonna pay. And I'm here to tell ya, ya is gonna pay. Well, Miss Penny, no what's Bobby? In the name of God, Penny, what difference could it make? What difference? Times are hard, our cash is tight, you've got no right, I've heard it all before. Just this one, this one's too much for once they want to, the one who wants, wants more. I run the only toilet in this part of town, you see.
better now, and that's all I care about. <laughs> <laughs> Always knew we'd get you in the end, Joseph Strong. Take him away! Bobby! Pa! Don't forget me, Bobby! And then tell your mother! Oh! Tell your mother I love her! I will! Remember me, boys! Oh god, what have I done? Remember me! <laughs>
Nonsense, Hope dear. Did I send you to the most expensive university in the world to teach you how to feel conflicted or to teach you how to manipulate great masses of people? To learn how to manipulate great masses of people, Daddy. Now that's exactly what we'll do. Now get back. And copy. And welcome home. Oh, 
Yes, real well. I have squeezed collateral a bit tighter than usual this month for our monthly payoffs, extortion fees, money bribes, and such, but. Caution, Mr. Lawson. It would seem we're no longer alone. Well, I'll be. And if I'm not mistaken, that there is his daughter. So it is. And I'll grow up soon. <laughs> Miss Gladwell! Miss Gladwell! I'd have been late, don't you think? Hello, officer. If I didn't know any better, I'd say you were on a late night behind the bushes to relieve yourself for a free kind of walk. Oh, no, <laughs> Just coming home from work. First day. Long hours. Just like us. There's some kind of big vote down at the legislature tonight. Plenty of facts. And copying, I imagine. Oh, yes, and copying. Well, I must say, Mr. Gladwell, your father mentioned the size and purity of your heart. He neglected, however, to mention the size and purity of your beauty. <laughs> the beauty of a size, officer? Oh, in some countries. I take care of that late at night on these streets, Miss Gladwell. There's no telling what some people wouldn't do for a few coins. What the new fee hikes and all. Oh, I'm not afraid of people, officer. Oh, no! Not really. You see, everyone has a heart. As long as you know that, you need never fear a soul. Everyone? Everyone. Even criminals? Even criminals. Even policemen? What? Bobby <laughs> Strong! Out of bit late, don't you think? I'm taking care of another late night rush or so, officers. There's more talks of free heist, and people are getting edgy. Oh, are they? Well, I'm glad to hear you are otherwise engaged. Wouldn't want to put you under suspicion for a late night behind! I behave. don't need to do that anymore, officers. Not while I work for a penny, I don't. But you do need to keep your head on the clouds, what don't do you? you? Mean by that? What do you mean by that? What she means is, you're a good boy, Bobby Strong. See that you don't end up like your father. And how did my father end up? Well, we're off. Our work's never done. Good night. Good night, officers. Night, Bobby. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care for policemen. Not those two, anyway. Policemen protect the peace. Do they? Usually. <laughs> hey, didn't I see you down by the amenity this morning? That was me, rushing off to work. First day. Find the way, all right? The gleaming town on the hill. Couldn't miss it. Beautiful. It's rather shiny. That's true enough. Did you mean what you said to those policemen about everyone having a heart? Well, sure. Because, well, because mine feels awful cold just now. Cold? Or empty. One of the two. Not because of me, I hope. Oh, no. Because of something I did. Bobby! Bobby, reason with the woman. I'm a little short this morning. No shorter than yesterday, unless I grow. Or rather, something like <laughs> <I did. laughs> If it feels cold, then it still must be there, don't you think? Unless it's a vacuum where you used to be. A vacuum. In your chest. It sounds so unpleasant. I did something wrong this morning, is all I'm trying to say. I can't seem to get it out of my head. Go back in. My action. I let someone down that I love dearly. I feel real bad about it. Well, maybe that's nature's way of telling you that now's the time to lift someone up. Really? Well, sure. You think you'd be feeling as bad as you did if you didn't have a heart? I don't know. I suppose not. Of course you wouldn't. Because then you'd be dead. When darkness surrounds you and you lose your way, you have your own compass that turns night to day. And it's even with you before you depart. Be still, be repeating, it's leading you. Follow your heart. Follow my heart.
you water? I guess I do want those things. There is something else your heart was saying. Maybe something I should have heard. There was? Well, it was fairly audible. But it doesn't have to be Well, what was it? Let me try again. Maybe I can make it up this time. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Piece of paper. 
Sir, the UGC would love to award public amenity number nine, the first of our new and entirely legal fee hikes, which we hope you will honor and enjoy. <laughs>
be off to Rio than I imagined. Already got my ticket. Good work on the phone for legislature, Fit. It was touch and go there for a while, I understand. Well, your beaches of Rio slideshow changed their minds soon enough. Just like it changed my mind those many years ago. God, I hate you, Claudio, by the way. Sorry to interrupt, Daddy. Just wanted to make sure you got your morning back. Well, I hope you're absolutely glowing. Seems office work agrees with her, both the vaccine and all. And the copying. Yes, the copying. You're a good girl, Hope Gladwell. I used to be one. Before my time. <laughs> Oh, 
a few rabbits. Let's go! Yeah! Yes! Prepare your 
pineapple. Well, you can't fight against my cousin. And I cannot fight against her. So you join us, or you can stand aside. You heard me. Oh, you'll never know. Would you release the girl?
beside each other. So I'll bring you to see a few things. Now, as you may remember, the rebel war under Bobby's leadership kidnapped broken user as a shield to escape to punishment from my man. The word has it they're holding up in some secret hideout somewhere. <laughs> Perhaps this one here. Keep on our tools from now on. 
five more seconds and we give her the roll. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> She gets the rope! The rope? Yeah, yeah! Wait a minute! You just can't give her the rope! Why not? Because! Kimmy and Howe won't make us any better than them! Aren't you hurt, little Sally? We are no better than them. In fact, we're worse! Worse? What do you think they talk about in those quarrels they got up there? How good we are? So listen up now, boys. Our adults are going to bust in here and bust us up like a bunch of overripe cantaloupes. So I say, if our juice is going to spill, our juice is going to spill too. Kill that well juice, then you'll see who's better than who. Look at us there, all bound up, back to tie, with her head full of hair and her heart full of pride. The boys, I've had enough of each arrogant girl. Big bang boom, let's get tough, play rough. Pocketbook. 
that no man in need would be ignored by another with the means to help him. From this day, because of you, you, and you, we will look into the faces of fellow men and see not only a brother, but a sister as well. What's that supposed to mean?
He says he now understands how unhappy the people of this community have become, and he wants to work on a solution with you peacefully.
Ah, oh, yes. The regulating mechanism of cash. Bobby, I want you to have this cash. And I want you to tell all the people that the powers that be grant full amnesty to those involved in this week's criminal activity, as long as they're willing to return to the group fee schedule as authorized by the legislature. Don't let it happen again. And have a good time in Rio. So many tomorrows. Yes. But I'm afraid my conscience will cost you more than a big bowel of cash, Caldwell. Bobby, it really is an awful lot of cash. Free access is the only cash I'm interested in. You're making a terrible mistake, Strong. There is a way to that brand new day that you always speak of. And we will find it together, OK? Not only the wealthy view, and that means free access. Free access is impossible. Then that's what I'll tell the people. Stop! We'll not return to the stinkiers, Mr. Strong. I'll not allow it. Pablo, what are you doing? I spent a lifetime building this company, bribing the police, paying off the political elites, and snubbing out popular resistance as if it were a Nazi baby bunny in the palm of my hand. <laughs> my right, I have centralized all power to a pinpoint spot, right here, in between these two ears. And I am not going to allow some dreamy-eyed boy who can't remember the stinkiest word all that. Seize him! Don't do it, Caldwell! There's no telling what they'll do to the girl! That's just a chance I'll have to take. Oh, no. <gasps> he really is a legal as they say! You think just because I love my daughter I'll stop clinging to tomorrow? Caldwell, what are you saying? I closed my heart to love once. I can do it again! Do you it out with him then! With all hate! I'm a son of a With all hate! You lied to us, Caldwell! Caldwell! Why did I listen to that man? Why did I listen to the nature of his plan? And when he talked, I should've walked, I should've walked, I should've ran. Why did I listen to that man?
dear God, no! You couldn't have! Oh, there you go, then. Wait! You just gotta toss me off this rooftop and call it your town? That is your town? Well, that's one interpretation. What do you say, little Sally? Who threw 
stopped me from having all your days. Why still giving now? Because Hope is my daughter. <laughs> Thank you. 
letting us put on this very strange and beautiful music.